hello and welcome to another video of website creators today in this video we will learn how to create e-commerce website front-end html css and as you can see on my computer screen here is the e-commerce website template that i will going to create in this tutorial first we have logo set bar and menu with cut option next we have vertical menu in the left side with sub menu also that's contain list of product category of this e-commerce website in the right side we have image slider after this section we have future category section we have three products next we have product section with beautiful title product image star rating and price you can see three buttons here whenever i take a cursor on image after this we have new products list we have added these products after that we have feature section we have added icon and text also in the next section we have footer with four different column and copyright text come again the product page now if i click any product image it's take to the product page here you can see sliding product image in the left side and product information in the right side with add to cart button also after this we have product description and some related products products also now click on the logo it will take on the home page so in this video we will create e-commerce website like this so before starting this video i request to please subscribe to my channel website creators to watch more videos like this one now let's let's just start this video this is my project folder i'm open this folder this one is html file and this one is css file in one more folder which is image it contains some images for our website now come back now i am open these both files as brackets project editor this is the html file and this one is css file i am written some basic structures here this is the bootstrap basic scripts and link which is css you come to the bootstrap you can find all the all the icons in this website fontawesome.com now i am write one class name top new bar in this new bar we will add one search box so i am add search box in this set box we will add one logo for that i am adding image remove this logo dot png we will add one class name also so logo now we will add one more thing input type text class name form control
that's it now we will add one span so in the span class name is input group text that's it we will add one icon here for that come to the google come to the font of some website for we will set the search icon now set the search you can find 42 matching results just click here search icon is a premium so I don't want to confuse you I'm use this icon HTML file this is the icon code now come to the index.html file open this index.html you can see one logo and search icon also now let's come to the HTML file now we will design this sections for that write body so in this body we will add some background color so we will add f1 f3 f4 font family it will be sans serif now come to the HTML file, copy this class name, top navbar, head here and we will add some CSS property like height, 57 pixel and top 0, position sticky. background triple F it is white color margin from the bottom 20 pixel and margin border from bottom so border bottom is 3 pixel solid we will add one color also so I am adding red Now we will add Z index also, so Z index it will be 2. Now save the changes and refresh your website. Now let's come to the CSS file and copy this class, come to the HTML file and copy this class name logo. In this logo we will add some CSS property like height 40 pixel and width. margin 5 pixel and 10 pixel now come to the HT website and refresh your website you can see it's like good logo now come to the HTML file copy this class name form control add here We will add margin top 9 pixel and margin left 30 pixel border 1 pixel solid red important because it is the booster class name now we will set some border radius also so we will add border top left radius border top right radius 0 border bottom right radius also 0 now co come to the 
website, refresh your website. You can see this. Now come back again, we will add box shadow. None. And height 37.5 pixel. Now come again in the HTML file and uh, copy this input group text. Background red. Border, border it will be copy this class name and paste it here. And we will add some margin, so margin it will be 8.5 pixel, 10 pixel, 3 pixel, and 0. And copy this. border top left radius and border bottom left radius and border top right radius and border bottom right radius and here change it into the zero no required this at the important now we will add some another one so, so cursor it will be pointer refresh your website now you can see this let's come back in the HTML file so copy this class name set box and here and we will write some things also so with 60 percentage and display inline flex so you can see it's come to the this type of nav bar now we need to design the search icon for that come to the HTML file and copy this class name for this search it is the unique name for the search icon so I'm here so we will add some color so color it will be white for that triple F you can see this color is white color right now come back now come to the CSS file In this input group text, add the important and this one also. Now refresh your website. You can see this color is good. Now come to the HTML file. After this set box, we will create one menu. For that we will add menu bar A add the class name and card remove this icon sign up duplicate this 
plug in now copy this class name menu bar come to the CSS file paste it here we will edit 40 percentage and height 57 pixel plot it will be right add menu bar and you will so in this you will, will add display inline flex and plot right copy this and paste it here we will add li for the list item so border left one pixel solid and this color code list style it will be none padding 15 pixel 25 pixel Textile line center background red cursor pointer refresh your website you can see these three items here now come back We need to design the anchor type for the copy this menu bar ul li paste here and add the a tag font size 160 pixel and color it will be white text decoration none and come to the HTML file and copy this class name fast shopping basket margin right 5 pixel now come to the Google now come to the website and refresh your website you can see this new bar is good so I hope in this tutorial video in the next video I will teach you the second part of this website design so don't forget to subscribe to my website creators youtube channel to get videos like this one Thank you so much for watching this video.